What's up guys, Trainer JT here, and I got a whole booster box of Forbidden Light today. Oh, been waiting for this in the mail. Oh, I'm pretty excited. Let's see what we can get out of this 36 packs. Here we go, first one up. I'm just gonna scroll through these real quick. So we got all oh, reverses of beast ring, that's awesome. And I got a hollow magnazone. Awesome, awesome. Let's see what I can get. There you go, fur for you. Oh, I got a prism card, what I get? Uh, Arceus Prism, I think that card's beautiful. That looks awesome. Where's a Rotom? Not too bad, not too bad. Oh. Thought down in the comments, y'all let me know. Let me know how many ultra rare cards I'm gonna pull. Let's see if you can guess how many I can get. So. Ooh, reverse is a heat shot on this over here and a Zygarde. Oh, that's the one I got the GameStop Hollow one of. Forgot that was in this set. That was a new thing, GameStop. I think for every set now, it's going to have a Hollow card. If you spend $25 or more, they'll give you that extra Hollow card. Because now it's, I oh, can't get them at Toys R Us anymore. First is Ultra Space, and our rare is Draggy, Draggle, maybe, I don't know, I probably butchered that one. Let's see what else we can get. I haven't pulled an Ultra Rare yet. I guess we got a Prism card, and that Reverse Beast Ring is pretty cool. Let's see if we can get a, get a full art. That's what I'm looking for, I love. Love how the full arts look. Reverses a Malmar. Oh, and I got a hyper rare Greninja GX. That card is beautiful. Look at that guy. I don't know. Some guys are trying to play him in decks along with Zoro GX. Seems like it's not a bad option. So that's an awesome first pull. I did not have that card yet. I'm gonna go ahead and pop them up in the back right here. That is awesome. Here we go, next pack. Frucky. Other tile reverse is a Noibat. A rare is a Heatron. Froakie. Froakie, Froakie, go along with that Greninja. Bergamite, Scatterbug, versus Krokot. Oh, Lycanroc Rare. Oh. I hope, hope all y'all's days go pretty well. Mine wasn't too bad today. Just got off work, came home and got to open the Pokemon cards, so can't, can't complain about today. Probably reverses a goodbye and a hollow diantha. I think that card's cool. I thought that card was gonna make Gardevoir good again, but I haven't seen anybody play it yet. Right now, it seems everybody wants to play Buzzwolf. This seems to be the big deck. With Leo, Clauncher, gonna go Rock Row. Guzzlord, reverse hollow. That is one of my favorite Ultra Beast. Pretty cool. Ooh, Mysterious Treasure. That was pretty good. I only have to discard one card and you can get Psychic or Dragon Pokemon. Really helps out those Psychic decks. And you need to go get Lele with it. There you go, let's go. Oh, Double Skidoo. And an Exert Tree. 
Man, only only one pull so far. Oh, I'm feeling like we're getting some of this one. Diantha, Exernius, GX. Put them right there. It's pretty cool. I think I have this one already, but let's go and take a look at it. What is it, Overrun? This attack does 20 damage when your opponent spins your Pokemon. Oh, so it snipes. Kind of like Buzzwool. Aura Horns is 120 for 3 energies, and then we got Sanctuary GX. Move all damage counters from each of your Pokemon to your opponent's active Pokemon. Ooh, that's interesting. Wonder if somebody could get that to work. Maybe I'll try that out one day. <gasps> we got a prism beast energy. I need oh, and a Zygarde GX. That is awesome, man. Those awesome pools. I really need that beast energy for. I'm making a Guzzle GX deck, and I needed that for that deck. So that's pretty cool. Let's check out the Zygarde. All right, this guy for a double colorless. Attach two fighting energy cards. From your discard pile to this Pokemon. Huh. And Lands Wrath for two colorless and two fighting is 130. And then for also the same energy cost, we got the Verdict GX for 150 and prevent all damage on this Pokemon by attacks from Pokemon GX and Pokemon EX during your opponent's next turn. And there's even a trainer card. What is it? Bonnie. It lets you reuse Zygarde's GX attack, which is pretty cool. And that beast energy, that when it's attached to an Ultra Beast, I think it counts as any type of energy. And your Ultra Beast attack do 30 more damage to your Pokemon's active, to your opponent's active Pokemon. Versus a Gumi, ooh, Malamar. Malamar is pretty good. Making all those psychic that good again. I guess they haven't been good for a while. I always tried when Sun Moon came out and Guardian Rising. I tried to play Lunala, but that was kind of hard. Definitely after Zora came out. Zora kind of ruined that for me. Oh, there's the Bonnie card that lets you reuse Zyker's GX attack. And then Noiburn. Getting close to halfway through this box. We got three Ultra Rare so far. Let me skip right to it. Carver, so, ooh, a Beast Ring, yeah. Those are awesome. I think those could be, oh, this could be. A real game changer, you'd be winning. When your opponent come back with a couple B strings, and you could be losing pretty quick. Ponage, Noibet, nice one. Identified Fossil, Reverse. And Ferramosa, Ultra Beast, Hollow Rare. That's the only, I still need that pre release promo. I like collecting the Black Star promos, and I'm missing the Ferramosa pre release one. That's the only one I can pull. Jam, Esper, Execute, Scatterbow, Drag Eagle, Reverse Hollow, and a Buzzwool. People are actually playing this Buzzwool too. He's kind of interesting. I didn't think he'd be that much of use, but I guess he, guess he is. People found use for him. Last pack of this first half. Inkay to start it off. Well, I think our Reverse is an Inkay too. There we go. Double Inkay. And me, I'll stick for the rare metal frying pan. I saw somebody played this in pretty much just a metal box deck. Just a bunch of random metal guys, and it won a League Cup. I think they even had Celesteela in it. I know that card hasn't been played for a little while. It was good for one. Oh, sorry guys, bumped the camera there. 
It was good for a regional tournament. I remember that. Everybody was playing Gardevoir, and then you weren't playing Gardevoir, you were playing Metal to Counter Gardevoir. Snow over Cubone Turkey. Del Fox Hollow and a Garchomp Hollow. Always, I haven't done it. I want to try out a Cynthia Garchomp Dex. Seems like it'd be pretty cool. Oh, Frogadier. Yeah. Let's try. Let's try to get an Ultra Rare, guys. Let's see. Tyrant Claw Ritzer. No, not in that one. Here we go. Hone Edge, Hippolyte, Skiddo, Duplier, Skybug, Empoleon, Hollow Rare, Living Cool, Steel Type, Pangoro Rare, Goodbye, Tyrant, Slew. I'm hoping I'll be going to the League Cup, not this weekend, but next weekend. I'm hoping to do well. Not sure what kind of deck I'm going to play yet. I know I'm making a Guzzler. Oh, double Gumi. Two different types of Gumis. Reverse is Scrum. A rare Aegislash. Don't know what I'm going to play yet. It'd be funny if Guzzler worked pretty well for me. But we'll just have to see. I know at my last League Cup, I played, this was before Forbidden Light was released, I played Machamp GX, and I actually got third at that League Cup, it worked out pretty well, I'll probably show the deck to y'all sometime, but it was also before, oh, Lone Executor, is that, it's a reverse rare, oh, and a Hollow Red or Reverse, oh, wait, let's check this card out real quick. Oh, it's almost the whole card is like hollow. I don't know if y'all can tell. Per Frost Wall, during your opponent's next turn, prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks from evolution Pokemon. Oh, that's like Glaceon. This Pokemon can't attack during your next turn for Blizzard Burn. 150. But yeah, oh yeah, the Machamp GX deck. I wouldn't be able to play it anymore because a lot of people are playing Psychic. And Machamp is weak to Psychic, sadly. And I loved playing that deck. It was fun. It was interesting. Surprised a bunch of people they weren't expecting it. Versus a Gumi and a Barbarical. Barbarical. Yeah, I'm going to butcher some of these. I feel like it's been a while since we pulled them up for rare. Let's see if we can get one, guys. Is that you cute? Ooh, maybe, maybe. I uh, kind of gave away there was a white coat. Oh, a Crusher Wig. Double Crusher Wig. Can we get the third? Oh, nope. It's a metal frying pan and a judge. This is my third Crusher Wig to pull. Looks a little off center. I'll give that one a look. This guy discard two water energy cards. From your hand, if you do, search your deck for up to two cards, put them into your hand. That could be pretty useful in any water deck. Yeah, that's just slightly off-centered there, but so cool. Full art trainer. That's my, my third one. Was hoping for a different one, but oh, can't always pull what you want. Can only hope for it. Open. Oh, it's not this set, but I really want a full art Cynthia. That'd be cool. But that's an Ultra Prism, which is still expensive. That's a reverse rare. And Torterra's are rare. Oh, not too much out of that pack. Oh, there we go. Prism. That guy's cool. I'm going to pick him back up and show him to y'all. Then was that? Oh, that was a regular rare low Marowak. This guy. Kind of the replacement for Reggie Rocky X when he rotates. It's going to be 
Princess Cheers its ability. As long as this Pokemon is on your bench, your fighting Pokemon attacks do 20 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon. That is pretty awesome. The only problem, he if you were to attack with Diancie, it doesn't add 20 because Diancie has to be on the bench. Here we go. Ultra rare, ultra rare. Nope. First is a unit energy and a pavilion. Cool card. He was good at. What was he good at? Pre releases. If you got pavilion, you poisoned him. It was bad news for you if you played against it. Here we go. Thank you. Ooh, I think we got something. I love ties. Well, Terra Reverse Wear and a Rivaltal GX. I'm gonna pick that one back up and show it to y'all. I think this one I already had, but let's check it out. Alright, so what we got here is Absorb Vitality for 20. Heal from this Pokemon, the amount of damage you did to your opponent's active Pokemon. A Sonic Eagle for 100 damage and 3 colorless. This attack attacks damage isn't affected by weakness or resistance. That, that's not too good. And then Doom Count GX. If your opponent's active Pokemon has exactly 4 damage counters on it, that Pokemon is knocked out. That's not that great. I'll get that. I think this is the first Wavelta card that just isn't that good. Normally Wavelta is pretty good. Well, I guess it's cool they changed change your pace. I guess. Snow over rock rough scrub let Leo Gibble Pyroar Hollow Rare Hollow Rare Mysterious Treasure Keep those to the side. Screw up with Leo, Krogan, Kroki, OBB, Pyroid, Reverse Rare, Sylveon, Regular Rare, Lady, Rapid, Clucky. Hold Edge, Profuse, Skiddo, Gumi, Finnegan, Halucha. Is he a rare? Nope, uncommon. Rare. Is Avalog? That's how you do that one. Fall for a bug mine. Spupa. Alright, guys, let's see if we can pull one more ultra rare. Let's see if we can get a full art. That'd be cool. Flavivi, Binnacle, Cubone, Gudra, Reverse Rare, Heatron, Regular Rare. Yeah, I love my favorite of the full arts. They're textured, colorful, they're. I think the artwork is always good on those. I like some of the hyper rares I like. I just think sometimes they're just all one color and the floors just look better. I'll be Snow Reverse, Scatterbob, Ruff Ruff, Pinnacle Reverse, a Guzzlord Hollow, awesome. False Exposition. Oh man, I'm getting, getting to the bottom here. Noibad, Gable, Zeggy, Hugh, Gimme, Bergmite, Smell, Malamar. Oh, that bomb so is a reverse rare. You see, Mysterious Treasure. Alright, guys, I feel like we might pull something out of this one. Let's see if we can do it. I hope so. Um, I'm hoping we get one more. Fanshin, Dupai, Finnegan, Hipta, Magnemite. Nope. Four guys. Crush your week. So here, let's just go over some of what I got. All the ultra rares. Don't worry, I'll sleeve these up after the video's over. Got white belt doll GX. Zygarde GX. Crush your week. The hyper rare Greninja. And Xerneas GX. Alright guys, 
Hope y'all had a good time. I was hoping to pull a little bit more out of this box. Only five ultra rares. That's a little, a little low. And actually, how many prism cards did we get? I felt like we didn't get that many. Of those. Oh, we got three. It's not too bad. Diancy prism. Beast energy. And Arceus. So that wasn't too bad on the prism cards, but. I was hoping for at least one more ultra rare, but it's all right. I'll open cards again. So let me know what y'all think. Y'all have a good one and come back next time.